Mastering verbs, the action heroes of English sentences. Hello there, language explorers. Today, we're diving deep into the fascinating world of verbs. We will specifically be focusing on the various types of verbs that you can use in the subject verb adverbial, or SVA, sentence pattern. Understanding verbs is essential, as they're the action heroes of our sentences, giving them motion, depth, and meaning. Let's get started. Before we jump into the types of verbs, let's make sure we're clear about what a verb actually is. A verb is a part of speech that describes an action, occurrence, or a state of being. For example, in the sentence, John plays football, plays, is the verb. It shows the action that John, our subject, is performing. When we talk about types of verbs, we're referring to several different categories based on the role they play in a sentence. Let's go through each type one by one. 2.1 Action Verbs First up, we have action verbs. These verbs describe what the subject of the sentence is doing. They indicate an action that can be physical or mental. For example, Maria reads a book. Here, reads, is an action verb showing what Maria is doing. 2.2 Linking Verbs Next, we have linking verbs. These verbs do not show action. Instead, they connect or link the subject to a noun, adjective, or pronoun that describes it. The most common linking verb is to be. For instance, in the sky is blue is is a linking verb that connects sky to blue. 2.3 helping verbs. Then we have helping verbs, also known as auxiliary verbs. These verbs, well, help the main verb of the sentence by adding additional meaning related to tense, voice, mood, etc. In, I have been studying English, have, and, been, are helping verbs assisting the main verb, studying. 2.4 Transitive and Intransitive Verbs Lastly, we have transitive and intransitive verbs. A transitive verb requires an object to express a complete thought, like, I love pizza, where, love, is a transitive verb and, pizza, is the object. In contrast, an intransitive verb does not need an object to make sense. For instance, she sings, where, sings, is an intransitive verb. And there we have it. A brief tour of the types of verbs we use in the English language. Remember, each type plays a unique role in our sentences, so it's crucial to understand them. Now you're equipped to handle these action heroes of sentences with confidence and precision. We hope this video has been enlightening and helpful in your journey of mastering English grammar. Tune in for the next video where we will discuss more about adverbials in the SVA pattern. Keep practicing, keep exploring, and until next time, happy learning!